A new twist in that shocking Cirque du Soleil tragedy when a young performer and mom plunged 100 feet as the audience watched in horror. Her death has been a mystery until now. Tonight, investigators say they know what went wrong. And as ABC's David Wright reports, Cirque du Soleil and a Vegas casino will pay a big price. More than 100 million spectators have seen the Cirque du Soleil perform over the past 30 years. In June, for the first time, audience members watched in horror as an experienced acrobat, Sarah Guillaume-Guillard, tragically plunged to her death. Today, Nevada's Occupational Safety and Health Administration ordered Cirque du Soleil and the MGM Grand Hotel to pay more than $30,000 in fines because the agency concluded they did not provide proper training and exposed employees to hazards. According to OSHA's investigation, the wire rope hoisting the 31-year-old mother of two up a sheer wall was severed due to the rapid ascent of the performer after it popped out of a pulley. She fell nearly 100 feet to the floor. Even for experienced performers, these high-flying stunts can be dangerous. A performer in Spider-Man was badly injured after he plunged from a Broadway stage. Both Cirque du Soleil and the MGM Grand say they'll appeal the OSHA decision. Both companies say that safety has always been a top priority. David Wright, ABC News, Los Angeles.